My name is Alex Cecilio. I'm a graphic artist, and I'm going to show you how to turn a photo into a painting in Photoshop. So here I've got my photo that I want to turn into a painting. And when you first get your photo into Photoshop, it may not be directly editable. So just go over to your layer that it's on in your layers panel, hold down control and click and select rasterize layer. And this will make it so your photo is directly editable. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to filter and I'm going to go to artistic. And this is really up to you what kind of painting you want it to look like. But for now, I'm going to choose palette knife because that is really what's going to make your photo look more painterly. So and in, these, in this window, you can edit you know, how big your stroke size is, depending on how much like a painting you want to look. I mean, you know, I'm going to turn it up just a little bit so that I get that kind of detail. And then you can mess with your stroke detail and the softness. And I'm pretty sure if you turn it all the way up, it's going to look a lot better. But then there's also different options. There's paint daubs, which will basically blur out everything. There's dry brush, and this will look more like a photo than a painting. And then there's also watercolor. Um, but watercolor, I wouldn't recommend if you're trying to make it actually look like a watercolor painting. It's more for like the photo effect. Because, um, I mean, I guess it kind of looks like it. But for the most part, I'd really recommend um, palette knife. But you could also do underpainting. And this will make it look like it has a texture um, on the painting itself so that, it, like I said, it looks more like an actual painting. But I'm going to stick to palette knife. And there your photo is a painting. My name is Alex, and this is how you turn a photo into a painting in Photoshop. Thank you.